order to make your own yeast culture, you only need three ingredients. One is warm water, one cup of flour, and then you stir that together. Jasper, you want to stir? And then, if you have it at your house, one small spoonful of active dry yeast. Now the water and the flour are both the food for the yeast. And what will happen is the yeast will start to eat the flour and it will start to make lots of air bubbles. Uh, you can leave a mixture of flour and water out open to the air and capture natural yeast. When you do that, your flour water mixture is bubbling nicely and it smells nice and flowery like, like bread would. Um, if it changes color or if it kind of gets to kind of a, a stink to it, it's probably got a bacteria or mold and you want to throw that out. Cover this. You leave this out and once this starts bubbling, you can put it in the fridge for several weeks. Um, and if you want to just restart the yeast, you just take a big spoonful of this and put it in a fresh flour water mixture and have it bubble again. Good job, Dad. Thank you. One of the things you want to do is cover this. You can cover this with a cheesecloth, with a dish towel, or with saran wrap. Um, and that way, that will prevent any harmful molds or bacteria getting into the, the flour.